Hey guys, my name is Ryan. And I'm Crystal. And this is our daughter, Sila. Oh. Yep, hi. <laughs> <laughs> and we just want to tell you a little bit about our story and how the School of University Ministry and Missions was a huge part of that. Um, so in 2008, we joined YWAM here in Pittsburgh, where we are right now. And in 2009, we got married. And then our first course of action after getting married was to move to Madison and do the, the School of University Ministry and Missions. The school has a major focus on leadership and strength discovery, which was incredible, incredibly helpful in strengthening our marriage and also opened up a new perspective in ministry. Yeah, I'd say more than anything, we learned what the true concept of calling really is. First and foremost, that we're called to know our caller, to know God, and then from that understanding of who God is, we then realize what He's calling us to do and, and who He's calling us to be in this world. So it was very practical in understanding that. Um, also, throughout the school, we were exposed to a huge network of teachers and people all around the world that are doing incredible things for God. I'd say every week we had at least three or four new people teaching us on Skype, people that are leading the underground church movement in China, people like um, Trent Shepard who wrote the book on, student, like, on, on university ministry and the strategic importance of it. And so meeting these people and getting such a broad perspective of what God is doing around the world was very, very helpful. Also, throughout the whole school, we were planning our internship, which, which would come after the school. And so it was, it was constantly um, enabling us to think missionally. So we weren't just sitting in the classroom all day taking notes and writing reports and that kind of stuff. But we were also constantly thinking of missional things that we could do afterwards. So it was, it was really good because we felt like we were on mission the whole time and we weren't just students. The flexibility of the internship was a nice touch. We were given the opportunity to, to sit before God and hear what He really wanted us to do after the school. So it was very releasing. There wasn't a leader telling us um, what they want us to do, but we were able to really see what God wanted to do in our lives after the school. And at first that was a little bit like iffy because normally we're used to just going on outreaches with our teams. Um, but the idea of us planning our own outreach was kind of a revolutionary new idea because it kind of forced us to come before God and say, okay, God, what do we do with all this new information, with all this new perspective you've given us? And so what we did was we felt God leading us to take a trip around the world and to uh, start working on a documentary project. So what we did was we traveled for 10 months to 10 different countries in southeastern Asia, uh, Africa as well as a few countries in Asia. And that trip just solidified so many things in our hearts about what we had learned about ourselves in the school. Um, we understood even better as a couple uh, how, how we can complement one another's strengths and weaknesses. And we also learned as a family how we can minister to those that we visit. Also, we were really able to make an awesome network of contacts that we plan to eventually take student teams to and continue to reach out to them. So I'd say all in all, the School of University Ministry and Missions opened up a completely new realm of ministry for us. It showed us that as individuals, we have an incredible calling and that God wants to use us in, in ways that we would have never known beforehand. And also, it helped us to see the strategic importance of the university as a mission field and how that can be the first place that when it experiences a revival and a reformation, that from there, the nations can be discipled. So I strongly believe, we strongly believe in the School of University Ministry and Missions. Um, we love John Henry, he's been an incredible mentor, an incredible leader, and the Student Mobilization Center, even though it's a small network, um, has incredible potential, I think, to really help lead YWAM into a new understanding of how the university can be engaged and how we can disciple the nations through it. So thank you so much, thank you for your time, and uh, yeah, God bless you guys.